guys. So after having a baby, it's really important to check if you have a tummy muscle separation before you do any sort of exercise that can have any impact on your tummy. If you have got a separation there, it can really affect your back and you can get a lot of back pain and have lots of other issues as well. So you really do need to know if you have one. Plus doing the wrong sort of exercises, if you do have one, can actually push the muscles further apart and actually train your tummy to stick out further actually. So we really need to work on closing those muscles if you do have one. So what I want to do first is just um, show you how to check to see if you do have one. And you could be six weeks postpartum or you could have had your baby 16 years ago. You may still have a separation there. And you will probably have noticed a few little things like you do get a bit of back pain. You might have noticed that you struggle to lose uh, your baby belly. And you might notice a little bit of a doming shape as well when you do sit up out of the bath or sit up in bed sometimes and put any sort of pressure on it on me. Um, so I'll show you how to check for that. Um, and then we'll go through some of the exercises that you can do to help pull those muscles back together. Okay, so we're going to start lying on the floor, feet flat down. And we're just going to take two fingers and we're going to place them onto the tummy just above the tummy button. And we're going to come up into a little crunch position so you can feel your tummy crunching. Now you need to push these two fingers. You might need to have a good wiggle around here, really push them into the tummy. Have a good wiggle around and see if you can feel the two sides of your rectus abdominis. So you should feel two muscles closing in around your fingers. Now what you're looking for there is a gap of two fingers or less. Anything wider than that is classed as a, a separation. And then I want you to check all up and down the tummy because you can just have it in one, one place. And if you have got a separation there, you need to work on closing that gap before you do do any more strenuous exercise on your tummy. It's a really common thing and our tummy muscles will separate anyway during pregnancy to create space for the baby. And sometimes they just don't go back into place straight away and they need a little hand sometimes. If it does get too bad and you do get a lot of back pain, you can speak to your doctor and they will sometimes refer you to a physio and you can go and do these sort of exercises at, uh, with a physio and they can show you some ways that you can work on improving it. Okay.